Happy Halloween gamers! Welcome to Pondera Ultimate Gaming! Are you ready to turn the lights off, crank up the volume, and dive into some spine-chilling games for Halloween 2024? This year's lineup has it all, from haunted zoos to parkour nightmares, and even classic remakes that'll make you question your sanity. I've got 10 terrifying games for you to try out, and all of them are released in 2024. Trust me, each one brings a unique horror twist to make this Halloween unforgettable. Also, wait for the end, there are some honorable mentions you might enjoy. So grab your snacks, settle in, and let's get spooky. Before I start, forgive me for using AI voice for this video. I'll not use it in the next video. Please, have mercy, and bear with the AI voice. Okay, now get down to real business. Number 10. Zushosis. All right, kicking things off at number 10, we have Zushosis. Ever thought your first night as a zookeeper would turn into a full-blown horror show? Well, in Zushosis, you're taking on your new role only to find out that some animals aren't exactly... normal? They're mutating. What's your job here? It's easy, try to save them, and of course, save yourself as you navigate through the creepy zoo. Remember? Your choices will determine your ending. This game is packed with animal caring mechanics layered with horror elements. It's unique, innovative, and honestly, a bit buggy. One bugged out animal refused to poop for hours, so there's that. But with 23 patches so far, the devs are putting in work. If you're an animal lover with a taste for spooky, give Zuchosis a go. Number nine, Spectral Scream. Next up, at number nine, We've got Spectral Scream. This is a 1-4 to four player co-op horror game where you're exploring the depths of purgatory itself. Imagine, scavenging for items in each chapter, trying to retrieve a mysterious orb, all while dodging freaky creatures around every corner. Here's the catch. If you linger too long, the area's master comes for you. These bosses range from ghosts to demons, and let's just say, Direct confrontation isn't an option. Instead, you'll need clever tactics to escape. And if you're a VR fan, you're in luck. Spectral Scream supports VR and is even nominated for the best AR VR game at the Unity Awards this year. Go ahead, try it, and enjoy the Halloween update event. Number eight, the devil is in the details. Sliding in at number eight is the devil is in the details. Picture this. You're trapped in hell, and the only way out is by beating the devil at his own game, with the help of a mysterious entity known as the Arbiter. In this game, you're thrown into an anomaly detection meets survival horror experience from a first-person perspective. The game's all about outwitting demonic forces using unique gimmicks and completing complex escape room-style puzzles. And now, let's talk about the features. From four distinct campaigns to randomized cursed objects and a prank system that makes every playthrough unpredictable, this game has tons to explore. Feeling overwhelmed? You can turn off specific settings, making it as intense or chill as you want. Halloween's a great time to jump in and see if you can make it out alive. Number seven, Finding Frankie. Coming in at number seven, it's Finding Frankie. Are you ready for a twisted parkour horror game show? In this game, you're competing against other contestants in what looks like a fun parkour show until things take a dark turn. Characters like Frankie and Henry Hotline go from friendly cartoon personas to disturbingly lifelike and sinister threats. There are all kinds of parkour mechanics, bar swinging, wall jumping, trampoline hopping, you name it. And joining you on this wild ride is Deputy Duck, a multi-talented, adorable companion who helps you scan, signal, and generally adds a bit of cuteness to the terror. Finding Frankie is the ultimate Halloween mix of fun and fear. Number six, the Axis Unseen. Number six is here with a bang, the Axis Unseen, created by one of the developers behind Skyrim, Starfield, Fallout, and Metroid Prime. This heavy metal horror game has you hunting ancient folklore monsters in an open world setting. But beware, the hunter can also become the hunted. With only your trusty bow and various elemental arrows, 
You'll track monsters by following their footprints, wind direction, and even blood trails. The in-game music by Clifford Meyer, featuring dynamic heavy metal and primitive instruments, cranks up the atmosphere to 11. Here's the warning. The players who are deaf or experience hard of hearing will need to skip this one for now, as spatial sound is a critical component of the gameplay. Accessibility options are said to come in a future update, so if you love stealth horror, this 20-hour monster hunting epic game is perfect for you. Number 5. Beyond Hanwell. At number 5, we're heading into psychological horror territory with Beyond Hanwell. This open-world horror game lets you explore Westminster's eerie streets, battling anomalies, and uncovering mysteries in a hyper-realistic version of London. You'll scavenge scarce resources, use environmental elements creatively, and follow a non-linear storyline that feels both campy and immersive. Every location in Beyond Hanwell brings its lore and creepy details making it perfect for anyone who loves an atmospheric Halloween experience. Number 4. Forgive Me. Father 2. What's Halloween without some classic FPS horror? At number 4, we have Forgive Me. Father 2, a Lovecraftian boomer shooter full of demons, darkness, and relentless action. With a dark, comic book-inspired art style, every frame feels like a page from a graphic novel. And let's talk about the weapons shotguns, rifles, launchers. You're equipped to bring absolute destruction to all things demonic. As madness builds, you unlock special abilities, and the intense soundtrack will have you headbanging while you blast away hordes of enemies. If you missed part one, check it out, then dive into this blood-soaked sequel. Number three, Still Wakes the Deep. Taking the third spot is Still Wakes the Deep, brought to you by the creators of Amnesia, a machine for pigs. You're an oil rig worker in 1970s Scotland, fighting for survival on an isolated offshore rig where every escape route has been cut off. And on top of that, something unholy is on board. With chilling visuals, top-notch voice acting, and a haunting score, this is a six-hour experience that's all about immersion. Throw on some headphones, fill up that glass of ice water, and let yourself get lost in the freezing waters of the North Sea, if you dare. Number 2. Until Dawn Remake At number 2, we have the Until Dawn Remake. Remember the iconic slasher adventure from 2015? It's back, fully rebuilt in Unreal Engine 5 with jaw-dropping graphics and refined mechanics. When a group of friends returns to a mountain lodge where two of their friends disappeared a year earlier, things quickly spiral into nightmare territory. This enhanced edition brings back the thrills with improved visuals and updated gameplay and lets you control each character's fate. Sure, it's a little pricey and still has a few bugs, but it's still a blast, especially if you love the original. Perfect for Halloween thrills. Number 1. Silent Hill 2 Remake Finally, my top pick for Halloween 2024 is none other than Silent Hill 2 Remake. This psychological horror masterpiece has been rebuilt from the ground up in Unreal Engine 5, making James's haunting journey through Silent Hill more terrifying than ever. As James searches for his late wife in the eerie fog-covered town, He'll face disturbing monsters and puzzles that dig deep into psychological horror. With an over-the-shoulder camera and enhanced graphics, this remake pulls you even closer to Silent Hill's twisted world. And the good news? It runs smoothly on mid-tier PCs, so almost anyone can dive in and experience the horror. You can check out my benchmark testing video here. The game is about 15 to 17 hours long, and I can assure you that you'll enjoy every minute of it. And before I wrap up, let's give a quick shout out to a few honorable mentions. Alan Wake 2, The Lake House DLC. Alan Wake fans, this one's for you. In The Lake House, you play as FBC agent Kieran Estevez, investigating a mysterious research facility at Cauldron Lake. The facility is experimenting with reality warping writing, but naturally things go horribly wrong. Expect twisted horror, 
mind-bending narrative, and a haunting atmosphere that keeps you on edge. If you love the original Alan Wake 2, this DLC is a must-play. A Quiet Place, The Road Ahead. A Quiet Place, The Road Ahead is a single-player horror adventure game inspired by the critically acclaimed blockbuster movie franchise. Survive in silence. You can also check out a similar game, Don't Scream. If you scream, you have to restart. Gory, cuddly carnage. Okay, it's not classic horror, but Gory brings its own type of carnage to Halloween. You play as a badass cat named Gory on a sentient, razor-sharp hoverboard named F-R-A-N-K, fighting an army of horrifyingly cute but deadly toys. The fast-paced action, combined with dark humor and splashes of gore, gives this game a unique Halloween vibe. Knock on the coffin lid. Dive into this roguelike deck builder where you wake up in a crypt, lost and without memories, surrounded by eerie figures. This game combines grim dark horror with a fantasy setting that feels inspired by The Witcher. This is perfect for fans of dark storytelling and strategic gameplay. Hashtag Blood. Ever wanted to be a high school vampire hunter? In Hashtag Blood, you're Becky Brewster, the newest in a bloodline of slayers fighting a vampire apocalypse while juggling high school and social media. It's a hilarious, spooky dungeon crawler where you root out demonic infestations with a mix of action RPG elements and over-the-top 90s cartoon vibes. This one's a wild Halloween pick for a lighter, fun horror experience. Dark Hours. Gather your friends for this intense co-op survival horror. In Dark Hours, you and your team are on a heist gone wrong, trapped by a supernatural entity that's determined to make sure none of you escape. Work together to survive, solve puzzles, and hopefully find a way out before daylight. Hellcard. Hellcard is a unique cooperative fast-paced deck builder roguelike game. Join other players' lobbies in fast-paced tactical card battles against the armies of darkness and the archdemon himself. Check it out, a Halloween event is live. Clock Tower Rewind is a remaster of the 1995 legendary horror classic Clock Tower game from PS1. It was previously exclusive to Japan, now released for everyone. Devilated. Devilated is an ultra-violent RPG old-school boomer shooter where you brutalize and cannibalize your demonic foes in equal measure. Eat their face before they eat yours. This is like, forgive me, Father 2, but in Devil May Cry Red mode. Lastly, you can also try the PC remaster of the original PS3 Shadow of the Damned. And that's a wrap on the best games to play this Halloween 2024. Whether you're into psychological thrillers, monster hunting, or just love scaring yourself silly, this list has something for everyone. Now, don't be shy. Tell me in the comments which game you're dying to play first. And if you enjoyed this haunted journey through the top horror games of the year, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell for more spine-tingling content. As I promised earlier, in the next videos, it'll be voiced by me. Thanks for watching, happy Halloween, and may all your games be gloriously terrifying.